let's continue Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. I've been really enjoying this so far. It, it's great. Um, if you're watching later on YouTube, thanks for clicking. Hope you've been enjoying. And I do have to apologize for the first VOD. I noticed that the audio was a little bit crusty. Not too horrible, hopefully, but it's just because I forgot to refresh the capture card because it has a habit of doing that shit if you don't do it. But I did it today, so hopefully the audio should be a little cleaner. Uh, yeah, anyway. Well, we're done with this area, I think. I got the hammer. Hi. Hammer! Hammer! <laughs> Wait, I can, I can hit Mario with the hammer? He was not happy with that. Okay. Test. What are you testing, confirming? Uh, so it's like... There we go. Oh, you know what? There were rocks at the bottom. Hold on. I remember the cave had rocks. I need to go back on screen. Cave? Hang on. Okay, I apparently can't break these. Just curious. Oh, you're having issues confirming with the chat. <laughs> yeah, Twitch does that from time to time. Sorry, I can see your messages. Other people have been chatting, so I don't know. It's just because they, they say single words, like, HAMMER! <laughs> you thought I blocked you? I wouldn't do that. For what, what possible reason? Maybe I decided I want to have a pure stream. Oh boy. Right. Yesterday I was making ramen in a game. And the reason I was making ramen was because the old man broke his back trying to show me how he fucks. So I think I'm quite a way away from having a pure stream. Also, not just two minutes ago, he just was yelling not. Cards. Hello there, pards! It's been a Goomba's age since we had any strangers in these parts. Now listen, fellas, if you want to ride in them rusty old carts, I won't go stopping you. But I advise watching out for trouble. Yep, no one knows where them rails lead. Still, 
I'll tell you something. You might just be able to find jewels by jumping in, uh, jumping a bit in there. And while you're hopping for loot, watch out. If you spot danger, just shine your light at it. Oh mercy, there I go again. I'm always boring folks to tears with stuff like this. So, um, tell me boys. Get a ride in the carts? Yeah. The DS version of the game is thoroughly enjoyable. This is the first time I'm playing it, so I decided to go with the Game Boy Advance version, just... What the... Oh. What on... Huh? Oh! I see. Sort of. Okay, I see. This is kind of hard to tell which was in the foreground, which was in the background, but I get it. I mean, honestly, just do twin jump. But I am, I am thoroughly enjoying this. This is a very fun game. You know, I figured because uh, we get the Mario RPG remake at the end of the year. Um, yeah. Try this out and it has not disappointed so far. Kind of sad that the developer um, of this series went under not too long ago. So who knows when we'll see another entry in this franchise. Ah, I needed to get 10. Nah, I'm fine. Unless it's something for the story, I'm good. Maybe I'll have to come back, but for now, let's just assume everything's fine. So I guess it's like, when they can't have mushrooms, they have syrup and nuts. Wait, it doesn't go any further. Yeah, it doesn't reach. Nope. Hmm. It's not the pathway. Yeah, this is just the way back. Hang on, let me look around. Okay, so that's all that does, but... Or is it really a case that I need to progress in the minecarts? I think it is. That's, pro that's probably why the save point is here. In case you really mess up and run out of money or something, I don't know. Okay. Yeah, let's try again. All right, get good. Is it really that I have to collect all 10? I also realized that it's by color. Like everything else in this game. I don't know why that didn't click sooner. Hmm. 
Whoops. Sorry, Weege. Oh, no. It, it's a penalty. I probably won't win now. Oh, all right, that's 10. That's the requirement. Yeah, why well, howdy, again. Well, fellas, this spot marks the last stop on the long, strange railroad ride of my life. But I reckon your adventure's just begun. Get to it, boys! <laughs> okay, so that was the way forward. I'm sure the remake is, is nice, but I don't know. There's something to be said about just these pixel graphics. They look really nice. Maybe that's just because... That's the kind of graphics I grew up with. Their eyes creep you out a bit. I mean, admittedly, Mario's pupils look a bit dilated. Like, dilated pupils. Too much NUT! <laughs> Ugh, people are gonna get tired of that by the time I'm done with this playthrough. But for those that missed out, it's like, yeah. Nut and uh, Luigi is just getting attack stats. Nothing but attack stats. It's like you have to put the fear of God in people when they fight Luigi. We forgot to mention one thing. We never taught you how to use your hammers in battle. Ready to learn? Sure. Then we'll explain it in battle. So to whack with a hammer. Mario uses A button, Luigi uses B button, as always. Talking don't do it justice though, let me explain by example. First, let's do some solo attack using hammers. Oh. <laughs> okay. Wait a sec! Press the A button right here, it's the same. Oh man, that's smart. But I'm a hammerhead bro, so I'll be fine, no big deal. Press the button when the hammer shakes. When it shakes, you got it. Oh, old green guy there should press the B button when the hammer shakes. So, next we gotta learn how to defend with a hammer. Now, press and hold B. When you release the button now, too long. Before the hammer st starts to shake. Do it again, man. Okay. So anyway, you get the idea. Wanna try again? Yeah. This is like a parry. Okay. What? Press the B button right here. There we go. Okay. Nah, I'm good. For hammer attacks, choose your hammer, wait till it shakes, and press the button. Perfect hammer attack. On defense, hold it, and then before it shakes. Okay. Did you get all that? You better have. You better look alive with those things. There are a lot of monsters that your jump won't do diddly to. You gotta learn some new tricks if you wanna get by them. I'm sure you guys will be able to take care of business. If you can't, you're gonna have to give us those hammers back. Hey, we're going back so we can ride the cart again. Yeah, cart rides are thrilling and filled with suspenders. You nitwit, it's filled with suspense. Suspense! Oops, well, excuse me. Why did I read it like that? Okay. 
hammer upgrade in the future. Yeah, I mean, this just makes me sad that I didn't have a Game Boy Advance, that's all. This would have been great. And you know, we didn't get Mario RPG in Australia officially until way later on the virtual console, so... This would have been the first uh, Ma RPG featuring Mario that I would have played. It would have been great. What the hell? Oh no, okay. See, I need to- I- this is where I, we practice. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Alright, it's okay, I'll, I'll get better at it. Damn it, too- too late. Okay. Ugh. There we go. <laughs> this just makes me want Paper Mario to just go back to basics, honestly. I love the stories in Paper Mario, but I just wish the combat... They would just give it up with the, the gimmicks and just go back to something like this. No, 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 Luigi. Shit. <laughs> That's not cancel. Oh, that got me. There we go. That's got to me a couple of times with Luigi where I'm trying to cancel and then I press B. And it's not cancel at all, it's attack. Come on! <laughs> Did that not hit? Okay, there we go. Yeah! Now we got it. No! Duh. Okay, how do I cancel? Back is trigger. There we go. There we go, got him. You have to be dead on with it. Ah, too late. <laughs> I'm reacting too slowly. Hammer! Hoo Hoo Mountain, Bean Bean, Castle Town. Ah! What the hell is that thing? That looks like that looks like Daffy Duck if he was a Diglet. Uh. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh! Okay, that's what it does. That was not good. Mm. 
gonna say, mm, just go for this thing. There we go. No level up. All right. Mero is uh, looking rather unhealthy. Nope. Get away from me, Daffy. Such a, it's such a weird looking enemy. I, I get the feeling they've never used uh, that in any other game. Legally distinct duck mole. Manic mole, that's his name. Ah, oh, no. I'll leave Luigi alone. Hopefully the level up is coming. Ah, oh, too early. Does this show? Next is 126. Okay, that's still a while away. What on earth is that? <laughs> that looks like wacky inflatable arm flailing tube man. I fight everything. Ah, just slightly too late. Too early. Okay, that seems to be in a whole different area. I can't get over this enemy's design. It's just the face it has as well. It's a little, it's a little dopey. Getting more used to it. Oh crap. Uh, back. There we go. Let's 
Wait, what did I run into? Ah, oh, it's probably a mole. I see them as the bigger threat, I don't know. Oh crap. <laughs> Whoops. It's okay. That was admittedly bad. Level up soon, hopefully. Bean Bean Castle Town Chateau of the Chucklehawk. Just want to make sure I've gotten everything out of here. I didn't die. Yoshi Theatre. Alright, that, that's piqued my interest. Wait, excuse <laughs> Damn it, what was that? What, what did I just say? I got distracted. They look like a Goomba, but it didn't seem 100% like a Goomba. Probably gonna make that the thumbnail, like a zoom in of <laughs> Mario about to lay down the hammer on that dopey thing. Yeah, what is this? It's like, is that a tanu Tanuki Goomba? Oh wow, okay. Ooh. Okay, they do multiple attacks. That is scary. What the? What? <laughs> Whoa! Oh my god. Oh no, that's not good. That's not good. No. Ah. <laughs> uh, all right. So let's not do that again. What the? What just happens? What do you mean one of them transformed into Luigi? Oh no, I'm gonna have to do all this again. Alright, let's just be quick about it. Yeah. Stop! Okay, and then quick. No, 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 no. Undo. I can't undo. Okay. Okay. 
Garnt Slart Nart. I'm going to go save once I just go to the top area here. Well, excuse me! I'm just gonna grab the stuff here and then I'm gonna save. So then, if it does happen again, I don't have to go through that again. That was brutal. Oh, that's just the way back. I know what that is. All right. You gotta remember. <laughs> auto save? What auto save? do all this. That sucks, but it is what it is. Oh no. Poor Ouija. As much as I want to go to Yoshi's Theater, it appears to be guarded by something very, very evil. Oh crap, wrong button. One damage hit. <sighs> so bad at this. Look at Luigi's lucky hit compared to Mario. I mean, that's the idea. Like, I want things to be genuinely afraid of Luigi. I wonder just how that thing looks, you know? Like, what kind of body does that thing have? Is it, is it a duck body? Or am I just associating it too much with Daffy Duck? assume a duck. It depends if that's a bill or not. I'm not sure that's a bill. It might just be a mouth. I think it's just... We're looking at it like it's a duck. But it's a mole, really. It's just... It looks like it has a tail. It's 
too late. Yeah, it looks like it has a tail. It's almost like a beaver. But see, given its long neck, you would assume its body is equally long. I don't know, I, I can't imagine like a stumpy body and a long neck. You thought it was some kind of worm, but it could be, I don't know. Definitely don't want to go near that shit. We're, we're far too weak for that. Oh my god. <laughs> Horrible. There we go. Can I jump on that? Oh no! Uh oh, Ouija's. Ah, oh, damn it. I thought they were going to go after Weege. Okay, they did. No, they didn't. That was lucky. bad at that. But when it comes to games, I've, I've just always been bad at any sort of parry mechanic. I, I just suck at timing. Oh, no. oh come on! Oh no, poor Weege. I was, I was lucky. Wow, they didn't go after him. That was rather lucky. We'd have to watch like a super slow motion of uh, the thing coming out of the ground. But the frame of reference I have is like Diglett and Daffy Duck, so that's probably where it's coming out. We're still a while away from leveling up, aren't we? 68, not that far. Ugh. Nah, I don't want to risk it. I'll give Mario a mushroom, but not Luigi. Luigi's still fine. All it takes is for me to play poorly.
they really don't get much experience. Yeah, let's just go to the castle. Oh, the music is great. Whoa. <laughs> the town was attacked. The horror. Please stop, make it stop. They attacked while the Bean Bin troops were in Hoo Hoo Village searching for Prince Peasley. Apparently this is the only store that's going to stay open with a town in such a bad state. Trousers? This is ordin ordinarily a hip and cool fashion house, you know. But for the time being, I'm leasing the place out to her. With a town in this state, we have to keep each other the best we can. Welcome to my temporary item shop. Sorry about the mess. With the town in this state, I'm only staying open as long as customers keep coming. So what do you want to do? Bye. Um... Feels all ale. That might be... I'm gonna get one. And then we'll get... Like, just that. That's fine. What are these trousers? Like this. What is- I want this. This looks important. It is said that the Bean Star is hidden up on Bean Bean Castle. What if- my gosh, what if Cacletta hopes to get her hands on the Bean Star? No! No! Bean Bean Castle. Cacletta went toward the castle after attacking the town. Queen Bean may be in danger. We have to rebuild the town as soon as possible. There's, there's no save point here. Nothing bad can happen. Like, I don't know, getting attacked by a Goomba that transforms into Luigi? Nothing specific. Halt! You there, Halt! You can't just waltz in on here! The town has just been attacked, which means the castle could be attacked at any moment! Lady Lima has instructed us not to allow anyone in to enter the castle, no matter what, whatsoever, no one, anyone, not blah, blah, blah. Having said that, if you still wish to enter, you must explain your names and your motives. What? You are the famous Mario? What? And you are the legendary Luigi? Uh, Luigi who? Shh, I have no idea. <laughs> If you really are the super superstar Mario from the Mushroom Kingdom, then prove it! That... that jump! No mistaking it! <laughs> this guy is really Mario? Shh, I can't be certain. Anyway, what business would you have? What business would the famous Mario and Louis... Louis... Uh, the other guy have in this castle? Bobbity bobbity. Um, yeah, I guess that's the thing. That's why I'm building Luigi to just, like, one-shot shit. That, that is my hope by the end of this, is, like, Luigi will show them all. He's already hitting pretty damn hard when he gets a lucky hit. Huh? Well, oh. I see, gotcha. What do they want? No clue. Enough! Regardless of all that nonsense, you may not enter. Now be gone! Prince Peasley's Rose! 
Are you friends of the prince? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Listen, I think maybe we ought to let these guys in. I've never really done a Luigi voice, but it's like, that's... It's pretty similar to Wario's. Oh, yes! <laughs> um, okay. Taking into account that Roy is that your wacky story, and your wacky story, we can allow you to enter. That was one wacky story, woo. Okay. Authorized personnel only. How do they know I just didn't kill the prince and steal the, the rose? Worst gods ever. I mean, if that were the case, we wouldn't really mess around, would we? We'd just murder them when they didn't let us in. Well, Master Mario and Master Luigi. I am Lady Lima, highest of the ladies at the court. The gatekeepers told me of you. Are you indeed the Mario and Luigi of fame, the superstars? Yes, I can't deny that such jumping is the hallmark of the Mario and Luigi of Legend. That is my favorite thing of this game. <laughs> Instead of doing like generic voice lines, they they just got Charles to just go ba 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 What are you trying to tell me? I oh, do speak up. Oh, such ruckus! Speak in softer voices! Now hear me. As you saw, the town is in ruins and the castle is under strict guard. At a time like this, I cannot allow a suspicious pair such as you to meet the queen. As the queen's longest serving lady at the court, I must act in the interest of her royal safety. Really? Hear my words! If you two are indeed the true Mario Brothers, you must prove it by repairing this castle's plumbing. If you are able to completely fix it, then you may meet Queen Bean. Now then, show me the work ethic of the superstar Mario Brothers. Wow, am I really going to do plumbing? actual plumbing in the Mario Brothers game. I feel like the whole their plumbers thing kind of lost meaning after a while. Are they actual plumbers? Yeah. I mean, the arcade game was like, you know, based on them being plumbers and uh, clearing pipes that have like blockages. I mean, at this point, they're about as much as a plumber as Dr. Pepper is a doctor. Things are tanky. There we go. Oh crap, wrong button. Luigi's not looking good. There we go. Oh, so close to leveling up. Crap. Oh, 
That's lucky that it, it went on Mario. Oh. There we go. Okay, uh, I'm just gonna go into hell. Nice. Oh, gee, I wonder what stat I'm going to level up on Luigi. Destroyer of Worlds. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Another plus three. Look at Luigi's power stack. <laughs> it's... Ugh. Very good. Very good level up. Oh, yeah. Wait, he didn't heal. I thought when they level up, they heal. That's actually great. It gave me a... Uh... There we go. It gave me mushrooms. Yeah, so Luigi's crit is doing nine. <laughs> Definitely doing more damage than Mero. Hang on. I just love just this good mix of platforming and RPG gameplay. Mushrooms explains the dilated eyes. <laughs> I wish I could do, like, uh, the voice that Mario had in the Super Show. Because growing up, that was, like, Mario's voice for me before Charles. Had a bunch of VH VHS tapes of, like, that, that show. It was more of a gruff Mario. Oh my god. It's also, I guess, because it's an American accent, it's just, it would be difficult for me to do. Whereas in Warrior, I don't know. It's just like, I know my, my Warrior impression isn't 100% spot on, it just doesn't sound like Charles is one. But you can picture Warrior having that kind of voice. It's like the right idea. Oh, no. Crap.
that's good experience in here at least. Whoops. Oh yeah, there we go. <laughs> Wait, oh no, I undid it! Okay, hang on. Maybe not. This is like whack-a-mole. Oh yeah! That's fine, I don't mind that. I want the experience. <laughs> I couldn't hit it. How does that thing- oh, that thing work up immediately. Luigi. Uh, okay. I was gonna let it. Got that. That's cool because these are the enemies from the arcade game. So it makes sense. Yeah, level 10. I'm going defense. That's good. I wonder what I'm gonna level up on Luigi. Tough choice. significantly higher now. Mushroom. <laughs> that animation is so good. Nice. 
nothing. Did I hit it? No. <laughs> Mario's lucky hit. The, the one that does a lot of damage is just... Basically, Luigi's crit. Luigi's lucky hit is gonna one shot stuff. I think this whole thing we've just been scammed into uh, doing a plumbing job for free. Nice. <laughs> Mario's, Mario's hammer, when it does the sparkle, is only doing five. Luigi's doing eleven. Yeah. Huh, okay, maybe I thought maybe a second time. Oh, okay. There we go. Four. What? Oh, but, but. High jump. Very generous with the uh, the mushrooms. Surprisingly easy. Hmm, I want. Oh, thank the stars, you saved me. The heroic, you heroic souls. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Could you be the Mario Brothers from the Mushroom Kingdom? What are the Mario Brothers doing in a place like this? What? You claim that I dropped the pair of you down here and I told you to fix the plumbing. Most perplexing. Why, we were attacked by Kakleta and her friends, and have been stuck here ever since. Hmm. Perhaps the Lady Lima you encountered was... <laughs> Foolish Mario Brothers, you have completely and pathetically fallen into my trap. Repairing the plumbing is the key to disabling the Beanstar security system. Kakleta! 
It is the hurrying time. We must take that bean star and fastly run away from this place. <laughs> At last, long, long last, I have in my possession both the bean star and Peach's voice. That thing that can grant all desires, the Bean Star. We have always remained at this castle, acting as its guardians. Wrong voice, but still. Protecting the Bean Star and keeping it out of evil's hands. There's no doubt about it, Kakaleta must be after the Bean Star, I don't know. Oh, heroic Mario Brothers, quickly now. You must go to the Bean Star. Go! You must not let the Bean Star fall into the hands of evil. Quickly, quickly, do not dawdle! up to do this <laughs> just in case okay oh we're too late the bean star the bean star and the princess's voice are already mine. Once we awaken the bean star with Princess Peach's voice, this world will be Kakletha's snack cake. Say, Mario Brothers, you haven't bothered to pay a visit to your host, Queen Bean. I thought you had better manners, wouldn't you agree, Queen Bean? <laughs> Perhaps the three of you can sit down over tea to discuss the finer points of foreign policy. Oh god. This is like Death by Snoo Snoo. Only one. Uh, all right, let's try jump. Oh no, I see, I see, I see. Okay, I see, I see. Oof, this is this is tough. All right, we're gonna focus on one hand. God, <laughs> the Lu the Luigi, the Luigi crit. <laughs> Nineteen damage. Okay, there we go. So weird, but I love it. Ah, oh, crap, wrong button. Time for Brawl's attack. Should probably use them. Oh, she's back. Oh, that was bad. Oh, 
I'm gonna try and do equal. So then, I mean, it's not too bad to avoid the hand attack. Too early. Ah, I see. It's hammer. Okay, it's bean time. Oh, shit. Ooh, it's bad. Can't let that happen again. So she's vomiting out minions. This time. It's fine. Fifteen's still good. Weege needs the heal. You know, given I haven't focused any anything other than damage, Luigi's health is not that low. So quick. I'm surprised that it hasn't, it hasn't caused me to spawn more minions for her. Like, I've, I've been pretty good at avoiding it. Oh, yay! <laughs> that Luigi crit. Oh, yeah. All right, there. Too early. Ugh, that was bad. Okay, we're good. Ooh. I think it should be close to being dead. I mean, Mario's stats are way more balanced out. I'm gonna go stash. 
Nah, not bad. <laughs> Meanwhile, the destroyer of worlds. Ah, oh, that's all right. So no, Cacletta forced Queen Bean to eat a belly belch bletch a belly bletch worm. That's what turned her into this. Our fair kingdom is doomed. Doomed. How will we ever return Queen Bean to normal? <laughs> What's that? You say the Mario's will, Mario Brothers will do something about it? What can you possibly mean? You speak of the impossible. It's either hammer to the stomach or just jump on her stomach. Why, there is no known way to spit out an ingested belly bletch. Well, except... There is that one way. The last resort. It sure isn't pretty, though. She may be able to spit it up if she drank the legendary Chocola Reserve from the Chucklehuck Woods. Okay, never mind. You'll go to Chucklehuck Woods? You'll find the Chucklehuck... The Chocola Reserve? Jeez. Oh, yeah! Well, if you're going to make such bold proclamations, I suppose I have no choice but to rely on you. Take this bean bean brooch and head southwest from the castle towards Chateau de Chucklehawk. If you find the Chocola Reserve hidden deep in Chucklehawk Woods, our queen may yet recover. That was a lot. doesn't work. Oh, hold on. I should probably hit the save point here because there isn't one. In oh, there might be one in town. Hang on. Unless that's changed. Let's see. Yeah, there is. Alright, cool. Mario, Luigi! Lady Lima had, has asked that you also take this thing along with you. Bean badge. That thing is a badge. If you equip it, you'll be a little stronger in battle. Different badges have different effects, so for now, if you get a badge, make sure you equip it. To equip it, press select to open your suitcase. To equip badges, select this icon. Here you can see the gear and the badge you've equipped with. Okay, Mario, time to equip the badge I just gave you. Select this icon. This is where all the badges you have are shown. Normally, you'd pick a badge. It's simple this time, since you only have one right now. Press A and you'll equip the badge. Now you're all set. Good luck and be careful. Oh, uh, sorry, Luigi, but if you want your own badge, you'll have to go buy one at the store. <laughs> <laughs> this running joke of just Luigi. No one liking him. Uh, listen. We're not, we're not about that. That badge, do you see what it does? It increases power. How do you unequip? I want to take this off Mario and give it to the... How do you unequip? I can't, I can't unequip it. <laughs> I can't give it to Luigi. That's annoying. Well, this was clearly made by an older sibling, that's for sure. Yeah, I gotta buy my own, apparently. The only ones who still worry about fashion despite the town's crisis are real celebrities. I have to set prices that won't discredit this place as a high-class boutique. So, uh, what do you want to do? 
Oh, there we go. Hot fashions. Work pants. The bean badge. We're getting it for Luigi. Castle. A badge for tourists. Recommended for beginners. Castle badge takes it to 50. Yeah, I mean. 56, 54. But see, I hate that it said recommended for beginners. That just that just puts me off buying it. I'm not a beginner. A badge for the both are, are pretty bad. All right, I'll still get it. It just makes Luigi stronger. Okay. Uh, the bean trousers. Work jeans gives more defense. More defense. The blue jeans. Luigi. The Bane Pants. I am 40. Mario was already wearing... Hang on, what is he wearing? He's wearing work pants. Okay, so that would give him more defense. That one. Oh, I get it. The color. Alright, that'll do. Going shopping in the midst of a major crisis like this? You're so wonderful. So, uh, what do you want to do? Leave. Hmm, I won't charge you to look. Not that there's much to see. So let me have a look at this. Increases power. Recommended for the kids. I mean, alright. What's. So, Mario's at 41, Luigi's at, oh, you know, just 56. <laughs> 56 attack. Apparently, this is the only store that's going to stay open. Alright, it's the same thing. They'll probably fix the town by the time I come back next time. Hello. Destroyer of Worlds. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Luigi's Luigi's doing 20 damage now. That's fine. That one shot. Luigi's fed up. Yeah, yeah, keep... Keep treating him like crap. See how... See how that's gonna take... In future. a good preemptive attack. I mean, they're not really worth fighting. It's like... Trash at the moment. Chateau de Chucklehawk, home of Chocola Cola. They sure like to <laughs> repeat words. 
Oh, no. Ah, oh, poor Luigi. Wait, is that up, right? Yeah, up. Okay, we need to climb. What is this? Travel here is permitted only for select individuals in order to guard the Chucklehawk Woods ecology. Oh, the Bean Bean brooch. The mark of special guests of Bean Bean Castle. Very well then, we shall permit you to enter these woods. There's another gate that looks like this. We hope you enjoy a taste of the incredibly full-flavored Chocola Cola while you are here. Oh yeah! I can't do the Luigi voice, so that's all you're going to get from that. Crap. I still haven't found a use for the beans yet. These things just get one shot now, so it's just easier to fight them than to run. And it's a little bit of experience, it's fine. I do wish it had music in <laughs> this. It's just super quiet. There we go. Brewing Chocola Cola Step 1. The main ingredient of Chocola Cola is Chocola fruit, which only grows in Chucklehuck Woods. I feel like this is a tongue twister. Hang on, I'm gonna finish my tea before it gets cold. Brewing Chocola Cola, step two. Place one Chocola fruit in a barrel that's been filled to the brim with savory syrup. Brewing Chocola Cola, step three. Tell funny jokes to the fruit until it laughs, releasing soda bubbles deep within the brew. Okay. Brewing Chocola Cola, step four. Bear in mind that the quality of both the fruit and the jokes will affect the brewing process. Oh, they're not. I'll be perfectly fine. Father of Chocola Cola, first generation Chateau owner, Bubbles. Oh, it's one of these. Find your way through the maze. Oh. Let's go. 
Hmm. Where is this going? Cool. Cool maze. I love the part where I can't tell what direction I'm supposed to be going. What? <laughs> what? Okay, for a sec there I thought Weege got kidnapped. Oh, Barry Blast! Criminy! The famous shadow thief Popple has been caught in full sight! Tripes! You think you're ready, do ya? Well, nobody's more ready than me, you see. I'll show you! Rookie! Rookie! Shake your leg! Yes, boss! Oh. Okay, I gotta do this voice, huh? Okay, Rookie, it's your turn! See? I want you to squash those red and green drips there. Yes, boss! Red and green! I feel like I know these two from somewhere. Weird! What? Rookie? Are you saying you're acquainted with those two palookas? Ah, uh, something about them feels real familiar. Makes me feel real mad. Quit your babbling, you. You two ugly mugs came here for the same reason as us. You want the fable to call or is that? Boo! Boo, I say. You really think you can beat me to the punch? Well, open up those ears, punks. I, Popple, Shadow Fee, Filcher of the World's Riches, bet you that I get the Chocola Reserve best. Rookie, get to it! <laughs> oh, oh, it's a fake out. Oh, he stole a mushroom. I'll be taking that, see? You dick, give me that mushroom back. Oh, how dare you guys try to mess with the great Popple! Oh my god. Dude. I oh know. The big wage. Okay, this is gonna this is gonna be problematic. We're in, we're in trouble. Oh, this is so annoying. I guess we gotta deal with Bowser first. This fight, this fight sucks dick. <laughs> I hate it. I 
for fuck's sake. Alright, just push the attack. Just ignore it as best as I can. This is just an- this is so annoying. Did he just steal, like, the big mushroom as well? I can't tell which one he's gonna go attack. Oh, for some reason, fighting these guys makes my gut flare up something fierce. Oh crap. Whoa, that was spicy. Great work, rookie. Just keep at it, see? He stole my fucking super mushroom. What an asshole. It's not going well. Ow! Oh, Ow! Oh, what are you gonna happen? Alright, there we go. Ah, rookie! Okay. Now go fuck yourself. <laughs> Ah, boo, I say, I'll remember this. Oh, that was an annoying fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rocky, you bloated idiot. Who took you in when you were dazed and lost on the mountain? Me, you worthless vermin. Oh, I'm so ashamed. Meh, I don't care. See, we're fine as long as we get the Chakala Reserve. Let's not mess with these two knuckleheads. We'll scram and hurry on ahead. Yeah! That sucked. <laughs> but the, I guess it's been very... Uh, very nice of giving me a lot of mushrooms. It's just I lost quite a few of them, though. I'm sure it'll be fine. Hi. I've been saved, rescue, moi, Zutalors, allo, I'm the maitre of the chateau, Korka that is me. And moi, I am the petite brother of Cork. My name is Iskask. Kask. We were stuffed into these battles by two, two three bizarre characters. Are you the ones who saved us? I, I, that's a terrible French accent, I'm sorry. Well, I guess they're not French. Whatever whatever this is. Oh, 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 oh. To get straight to the point. The two who attacked us are after the Chocola Reserve that lies deep in these woods. Et vous, you do, are after the Chocola Reserve as well? Ah, oui, mm. The problem is uh, whether or not the that legendary <laughs> soda even truly exists. It sounded like a German accent. Oh, I don't know. 
the only time I can kind of do French is like the SpongeBob thing where it's like three hours later. But even the two of us have never seen or drunk that famed drink, the Chocola Reserve. Behind Chocolahawk Woods is a sanctuary no one touches. Getting there is not easy. Eh, what? Quoi? Vous can stompez on an enemies? And hammer rocks to lit little bits to make paths, are we? <laughs> uh, mm, per perhaps Vus could get through this wood, but not with these moves alone. Cask, perhaps with that wonderful hammer. Mm, oui, très bien, mon frère. Indeed. Old Moi was thinking the exact same thing. Aham, pardon moi. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I know it's, I, I know it sounds horrendous. Oh ha ha! I should have just done that, just gone oh ha ha! That's how you do French. Oh ha ha! I mean, I, I know how bad it was. After having a teta teta or teta ta 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 a ta ta a ta 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 a ta 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 teta a teta with mon frere just a moment ago, we have decided. Thank to Vu for helping us. We have decided to teach you armor techniques. These are techniques have been perfected and refined, passed down here at the chateau. If you master these, they should help you on your bon voyage in these woods. Do you wish to try these armor techniques? First, Monsieur, Monsieur Green, give me your armor. Hmm, oui. I see, with this hammer, press the L button to choose your hammer. hammer. Press the B button to swing. Et voila! That is the secret hammer technique. Swing the hammer eye and watch it plunge down with the wajevri uh, of the woods. Jeez. Anyone to eat with such a technique will become micro-sized, we oui, try, try petite. Anyone this size would feel like a mouse. You could go into tiny holes for micro-adventures. To return to normal, just swing the hammer again in a superb rock d'amour. Allez, go try it. Oh, incroyable! To think you could produce the uh, joie, joie de vie. I, I, I took French in high school. I have forgotten all of it. It was I was like a, a teenager. Of the woods in the first shot. Uh, uh, alors, perhaps you should uh, try to put him back to normal. Okay. Like basic rules of French. Excellent, magnifique, Vu could be a genius. Hmm, now then, Monsieur Red, give me your hammer this time. This time, press start to switch positions. Zan, press the hammer, press the L button to select your hammer. Press the B button to swing. This, this is the ultimate hammer tra technique. Très bien, no? Crashing down on a gust of wind with the hammer of the earth. Whoever is struck by this hammer will be completely buried and eaten in the earth. 
Of course, in this state, moving with the control pad is impossible. One feels like such a mo one feels much like a mole. Why, Vu can even sneak under fences for micro adventures. To come back above ground, just press the A button. Ale, go try it. Ah, boom! The power of the earth crashes down in a burst of wind. That was perfect. Ah, we oui. just press the A button to pop up out of the ground again. Fantastic! Now it is time to put these new armor techniques to the test. Use the techniques you learned to get the two cola goblets in the next room. The two goblets of which I speak of are the two the Bean Bean Kingdom's greatest treasures. S the sparkling glass is brilliant, and it is the perfect reward for you who have gained these techniques. So, monsters, procure, procure the two goblets. Jeez. What languages did they offer in high school? You had a choice between French... It wasn't even a choice, it was like, so... They split it up. Half the student body did French and Indonesian, and the other half of the student body did French and Japanese. Yeah, and then the next year, you picked out of the two which you wanted to stick with. So I did French and Japanese, thankfully. In Indonesian is, is not a useful language. In t just because not a whole lot of countries speak it. That's just because it's a neighboring country. So, I did French and Japanese, and then I stuck with Japanese. And neither of the two languages stuck. I'm not fluent in either. It's, it's, high, it's high school learning, like... Okay. I would have liked to have done Spanish. Oh, I see. Luigi has, like, a different power. Emma. Yeah, like, Spanish, French, German, or Polish. That sounds much better than what I had to choose from. Although Japanese is useful. Green goblets. Okay. I love how Mario's just avoiding the hammer. Oh wait, no. Hang on. go. Right, that's how it works. It's like the inverse. Okay. Oh no, you can jump. There we go like a tiny jump. Okay, got it. You did fan Spanish because your best friend at the time spoke it, so she said she would help you, then you start being friends, and you have to figure it out on your own. Uh, Spanish is not too bad. And the thing about Spanish is, like, you can pick up other Latin-based languages. Not too tricky. It's not too tricky. Oh, you got the red goblet and the green goblet. Monsoors, you are amazing. Incroyable. 
There is nothing left for us to teach you. You have mastered the armor techniques perfectly. Well, monsters, you may enter the Chakolak Woods in search of the famous Kola, Shakola Reserve. Listen, the most important, the most important sentence you will learn in Spanish is Yo quiero alas de pollo. That's all you need. It's the most important sentence in the whole language. Guess what down here? Chuck Woods. Oh, no. oh, what is that? They look like urchins. Pest nut. Ah. Oh. Man, the dodging's getting a lot harder. <laughs> okay. No, we're getting we're getting rid of this. It is getting late, so my <laughs> reflex is not doing well. things you have to do was you're going to a picnic and you have to tell your friend what you were going to bring in a certain number of words. Right. Emma. I don't know, man. <laughs> I have Can I say, like, outside of family, like, okay. In terms of family events, or just I guess growing up. I don't know how how I want to phrase this, but like I don't think we've ever used the term picnic ever. Like barbecue, sure. That's probably the most common one. Like we're having a barbecue and this is what we're going to bring. We're having a cookout. This is what we're going to bring. Picnic? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's just maybe it's just how I grew up, but like picnics are not exactly seen as the activity that uh, we would do. Destroyer of Worlds gets stronger. Emma. 
Oh, come on. How did that not hit? I think in this regard, it's, it's just easy to jump as both brothers, honestly. Just assume both of them are going to get hit. Damn it. It's all right. It's honestly not a bad tactic. I love how Luigi still messed up that attack, but still did about as much damage as Mario does. Defense. Nice. Yeah, what is this? I've seen this multiple times, but no idea what it is. There's no interact button either, so I don't know. Maybe it'll be something that's more obvious later. to be a way to go that. Whoops. Okay, no, it's just... There we go. Because we lost a lot of mushrooms. I need, I need mushrooms. This is a region map. It shows you your current location and the location of save albums. If you lose track of where you are, just check him out. There's a save album next door. section looks like it's going to be very lengthy. I do like this, it's pretty cool. How do you jump as Mini Mario? Oh, like that. There we go. What? Oh, there we go. That was weird. There's a bean icon. Poems of Love, Volume 1, by Bubbles, original owner of Chateau de Choc. An empty barrel, so like the heart of a man, tunnel from below. Ow. Oh. Okay. So, you know, I just destroyed the, uh... There we go. Uh, tunnel from below. Oh.
I love this game. This is this is great. I think if I just assume both brothers are going to get hit, that's... Unless it's super obvious, it works well. This is worth doing because these, these seem to be dropping mushrooms. Oh, hello, new enemy. Oh, no. Oh, Luigi, you got hit. I don't know what that thing in the background is. What is this? Oh, no. You have to jump over them. Damn, Luigi, calm down. This was a good area to go to. Refreshing ad, -ba. Oh crap. No! Oh, this, this was a waste. I gotta make sure I have the correct thing when I do that. What are, I mean, what are these bean things exactly? Like, there was something that their queen is, is vomiting out. Like, are these babies? What are they? Do all things in that kingdom start off as that? Are they corrupted? Like, what are they? I still haven't figured out what they are, really. Like a hairball, but they're sentient. Yeah. 
Bombs of Love Volume 2. Bubbles, original owner of Chateau de, Ch de Huck. Atop a barrel, man, I spy new lands with visions. Green, be barrel, man. L picks up the barrel icon. B climbs on top. Uh, let me deal with this. These things are gonna get in the way, so let's just get rid of them. <laughs> oh no, they can... They can disable for an attack. Alright, it's fine. I want to get rid of him. Ooh, Mario's a little low. Uh-oh. Let's just do that. I know I'm gonna fall down multiple times and this thing they're just gonna get in the way, so let's just yeah. Oof, you just barely make it. Okay, then Weege goes under. Okay, um Mero jumps. Swap. All right, what, what, what does it say? I can't read. That didn't help. Green be barrel man, and then Mario picks up the barrel icon and climbs up top. It's probably a little clunky. The barrel doesn't respawn, does it? Hmm. That sound effect. <laughs> That's jumped on top of barrel, apparently. All right, whatever. Generic Charles Martinet sound. Uh, 
Hmm. I am Chucklerid, protector of the woods. Ahead is a great tree, Mother Chakala. Only some may pass. Some who find all three kinds of Chakala fruit. White Chakala fruit. Red Chakala fruit. Purple Chakala fruit. I thought they were about to do the French flag for a sec. Uh, obviously, like, the other way around, but still. Find the three types of Chakola fruit here, then I let you pass. Could have been worse. Destroy our voils! Get him! <laughs> oh no, it, it's actually bad. <laughs> Luigi got poisoned. doesn't look so good. Oh, no! We'll be fine, just... Luigi got no... <laughs> ah! Oh, no. Poor Luigi. Um... Defense. Wow. Mero's looking great. Uh, Luigi's not looking hot. Does saving heal them, or is this all, like, manual heals? I think it's all manual. Yeah, wait. Yeah, Luigi's still... ...exhausted. Alright. It's a good thing I have those, uh, miracle herbs. Oh, man, I have to... There's multiple of these things. Oof, not good. down. Luigi's is going to level up now, so it'll be fine. Or he's going to get po- <laughs> He's going to get poisoned again. Alright, there we go. Man, I don't know what stat to level up. Damn it. How's his health? I, I, I just healed him. Oops. I mean, I like to think it's because Mario is, like, a little more thick. That's why he has high defense. Oh, 
Not like warrior levels of thick, but thick enough. Has good installation. I know I don't have to fight everything, but I, I kind of want to. Whoa, golden? Golden bean? Is that like a shiny Pokemon? Did I do something wrong by murdering it? Like, whoops. Maybe I did something wrong by murdering it. Maybe I needed it to le let it live. Oh, I got a- Whoa, I got a badge. What, what's the badge? The spike badge. Spiny killer jump. Jump for two times damage on spiked creature. Are you telling me that- Holy shit, Luigi's da <laughs> Luigi's damage. Alright, Luigi's just gonna fucking decimate spiny creatures. I, I want to see- I want to see this. Hang on. Hammer. Alright, here we go. Dude, that's- <laughs> 30. That's without a crit as well. Okay. I mean, after this area, we'll, we'll swap back, but like... I am the granddaughter of the great Chocola... Wait, the great Chuckle Root. This is my room, and I... May I say, how dare you enter a woman's room uninvited? Well, since you're here, I'll share my secret with you. Have you noticed the spots on the ground that look like this? Yes. These are spots where beans lie buried in the ground. If the green one digs beneath the earth, the beans will pop out of the spot on the ground. There are a total of five beans hidden here. Find all five and I will open the door up ahead. Damn it. I wish I would have known that sooner. That would have been a mechanic worth sharing sooner. So tutorial then. You found all five. You've done very well. If you find marks like these on the ground, dig them up immediately. Good night. The hell is that? A wiggler? Ah, okay. 
The destroyer of worlds, do the thing. Oh. Ooh, that's that's interesting. Jump right. Why are you constantly going after Mario? All right, time for the big wage. Do it. Start from the other end. Oh. Well, that's one way to simplify it. What a weird fight. ones are like the less likely ones that you're going to hit in the jump. Chopper Bros. Dunk Luigi and attack. Whoa. <laughs> that was cool. Okay, now we can go. Red Chocola Fruit. At least it lets you do this each time. Oh, crap. 
<laughs> I didn't see it. Uh oh. I'm just gonna jump with both, it's it's just easier. I wonder what's the stat I'm gonna go on Luigi. Such a tough choice. <laughs> I want. I bet the cap's like a hundred. It won't let me go above a hundred. Take advantage of this ridiculous jump. Oh, cool. That was two mushrooms. Nice. It's making up for all those mushrooms I lost. Yeah, this is good. Making up for all those heals I lost. Poems of Love Volume 3 by Bubbles, original owner of Chateau de Chuckle Hop. When too a distant, pressing start, but once will do. Souls will reunite.
Okay. Play some there just in case. I don't know, I was worried something was gonna happen. Okay. I'm not sure if that was the way I was supposed to do it, but it worked. Okay, so just one remains. Wait, where is that? There's no central door. Bring one more chocolate fruit type, then I'll let you pass. Purple chocolate fruit. Okay. Alright, there's a map here. There's a door to the south. Looks like there's two passageways this way, let's see. Yeah, we haven't been here. No. Luigi's about to get destroyed. taken out one on its own. There we go. Got the jump. separate one to Mario. Crap. Okay. 
purple chocolate cave. All right, that's all we want. Um, Syrup. Okay, what is this cave? Nice, thank you. Let's just jump. This old thing. What? Oh, there we go. What? I was wondering why it wasn't working. There we go. Jeez. Brian could not compute it for a sec. That was surprisingly straightforward. Why? <laughs> I don't believe it. the barrel. Right, this is further back. Okay, there we go. Save it. And all three cola fruit types, I'm amazed. Very well, you may pass. Very well. Go. Yeah, yes, oh yes, the path is open. Yeah, we are stuck and we couldn't get past you, see? Hiding here and waiting for a couple of schmoes was brilliant. Alright, rookie, let's not waste any more time. We're golden, see? Crap. Luigi's like, hammer! Time to beat the fuck out of them! <laughs> oh my god. Already at the ready with the hammer. Safe point, at least. How am I for health? Yeah, let's just... Syrup. 20 bro points. We haven't really been using bro points, so we're fine. What do idiots drink? What do sodas call their dads? Pop! 
A hippie's favorite soda, granola cola. My name is Bubbles. I built you to the Chuckle Huck, and I found the Chocola Cola Inc. And I am the ultimate comedian. With the laughing and the chorting and the ha 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 ha! Yes, monsieurs. Indeed. What you see before you is the most legendary of sodas, the Chocola Reserve. And I am pleased to tell you this Chocola Reserve is yours to enjoy. Ha 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 ha. I've worked on Chocola Reserve for a hundred, a thousand years, telling joke after joke so it would mature and then mature some more and then yet more until at last the greatest soda of all would be completed with the fizz and the tastiness because it is a soda of such high caliber and repute rude guests meet a fate such as this and uh, toi. <laughs> that's no ordinary soda see we can't stand up to such a beverage <laughs> The Great Chocola Reserve is a thing to savor, with the flavor and the tang and the yum in the belly. Oh my. Ah, it is wonderful, so wonderful, the great soda shines. However, that was not the only hidden soda power that my jokes have bred over the, these thousand years. Now I insist you fully experience the taste, the taste, the texture, the aroma of Chocola Reserve. Bon appetit. Oh crap. Okay. Um. We'll try, di we'll try different things. All right, so you can't hammer. Different form, okay. This should work. Oof. <laughs> Damn it. Hammer. What if we take out the shield? Whoops. But surely the shield's got to break at some point. There it is. Savage Luigi with the crit for 34. Oh my god, I'm doing horribly. Alright, that works perfectly. Item. Mushroom. Consume. Damn. Oh my god. I'm doing a horrendous job avoiding. I think my reflexes are just shot at the moment. Oh, come on. Okay, that was better. Really? I'll be fine.
Come on, Luigi, give me a crit. Damn it, didn't hold it long enough. Ah! Dude. Okay, Mario has to heal now. Destroy our worlds! Get the crit! Ah. Damn it. Oh. It's jump time now? No, it's not. Who hears horse horses? Oh no. So the hammer's the only effective thing. Oh, yeah! That was that critical hammer. Sticking to health. Yeah. Ah, damn it. Still, <laughs> Luigi's power just grows. No! But, but the jokes, the puns, the humor I've saved up over the last. <sighs> Thousand years. Au revoir. Uh oh. Is this about to become what I think it's about to become? <laughs> it's just about to go. In the direction I think it's gonna go. Oh shit, Mayro's missing now. Well, we're still gonna fight as Weege. Yeah. Didn't stand a chance. Remember, the L is for winner. Yeah, I mean, it's a good chance for him to catch up on experience that he missed out on. Luigi. 
Whoops. Okay, we're taking care of the poison tree first. <laughs> it's just immediately get stomped. I'm sure at some point Mario's gonna get his own solo section just to balance that out. Luigi. Crap. All will fall to Luigi. Definitely worth doing. Oh, okay. <laughs> Doesn't rescue Mario from the barrel. I don't know if he's sa entirely safe in there, dude, but okay. You know what's best. Oh my god. Hmm, well, look at this. A very Mario S fellow and a Lou. Ah, uh, some other guy. <laughs> what? What is it? Mario's gut is filled to the brim with Chocola Reserve. It's sloshing around his insides. Gross. That's terrible. And sort of disgusting. We must contact Lady Lima immediately. Hmm, by the way. What's Chocola Reserve? Shh, I have no idea. <laughs> Queen Bean has been in a deep sleep, just as you, uh, you see her now. Did you truly obtain some of the legendary Chocola Reserve? I can't believe this. <laughs> Alright. Oh, yeah! Bruh. There's the belly black worm. Uh... <laughs> oh, success! A truly repugnant yet tremendous success! Queen Bean has returned. Ah, that's the hardest I've laughed in a long, long time. Well done, Lady Lima. Now, Your Highness, it is not I, but rather the Mario Brothers, whom you must thank. Hmm, so Cacoletta has stolen Princess Peach's voice and then the bean star? It was my fault. Nonsense! But why would Kekleta steal the Beanstar and Princess Peach's voice in the first place? The Beanstar is the protector of this land and has the power to grant any and all desires. To prevent such power from being used for evil, the Beanstar was cast into a deep sleep. It is said that the voice of a great beauty is required to wake the Beanstar from its slumber. It must be the voice of a pure and noble soul. In this day and age, Princess Peach is the only one who possesses such a voice. 
So, the reason Kakleta stole Princess Peach's voice... Aha! She must plan to awaken the Beanstar and fulfill all of her desires. And there's no mistaking her one true desire to rule the world. Fear not, I foresaw this desire of hers long, long ago. We are prepared. Card for card, we have a better hand than she. Your Highness, Prince Peasley has arrived. Perfect timing, Master Mario, Master Luigi. Head out to meet, meet Prince Peasley. Cheers to Red and Greeny. Thank you for your help earlier. Yes, thanks to you, my secret mission is about to pay off. <laughs> Prince Beasley, excellent work on your mission. Have you learned the whereabouts of Kakaleta? <laughs> thanks to you. Absolutely. Southeast of this castle is Woohoo University. Our local research institution, Kakleta and her underlings, have just snuck in there, into Woohoo University. Yes, of course, Woohoo University is the perfect place to awaken the Beanstar. I intend to march into Woohoo University right this instant. May we meet again. Master Mario, Master Luigi, and this may be your chance to recover Princess Peach's voice. I shall inform the locals you are to be allowed passage on the road to Woohoo University. It actually hurt to do that voice a little. <laughs> I'll be fine. I can't believe Mario threw up soda and in her mouth, and that's- that's how we rescued her. That's- that's great. Alright. This is a good, logical stopping point for today, in terms of Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. If you're watching later on YouTube, thanks for sticking around to the end. Hope you have been enjoying the playthrough so far. And again, hopefully today's audio quality was better than yesterday's. Sorry that the, uh, the Elgato decided to do weird shit, but yeah. Thank you so much for sticking around to the end. Consider clicking buttons for algorithm purposes or watching more stuff with the two thumbnails I'm sure are appearing on the screen as of this moment. Anyway, bye YouTube.